Hello my dear goinkins hope you are all fine students will continue with the topic measurement of length and in this module we are going to solve some word problems let's begin question is rakesh is 1.35 meter tall mahesh is 130 cm tall who is taller by how much so here students in question height of rakesh is given to us which is equal to 1.35 meters students first of all we will convert this meter into centimeter so we know that 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeters so therefore 1.35 meter will be equal to 1.35 times 100 centimeter which is equal to 135 cm therefore height of rakesh is equal to 135 cm now height of mahesh is also given which is equal to 130 cm now students we have to find out who is taller so on comparing both the heights it's clear rakesh is taller than mahesh but students we have to find out by how much rakesh is taller so for that we will find out the difference so 135 minus 130 is equal to 5 cm therefore rakesh is taller than mahesh by 5 cm i hope student this is clear let's do another question we have Ankit runs eight rounds of race track every day. If the race track is five hundred sixty meter long, by how many kilometers does he run every day? So let's understand what is given in the question. Ankit runs eight rounds of race track every day. So here number of rounds are given to us, which is equal to eight. If the race track is five hundred sixty meter long. how many kilometers does he run every day so here again length of the race track is given to us which is equal to 560 meters therefore total distance covered by ankit every day is equal to 560 times 8 which is equal to 4480 meters but students we have to find out our answer in kilometers so we will convert this meter to kilometer and we know that 1000 meters is equal to 1 kilometer therefore therefore 4480 divided by 1000 will be equal to 4.480 kilometers therefore total distance covered by ankit every day is equal to 4.480 kilometers i hope students this is clear let's do another question we have salma traveled 15.5 kilometer by metro and 750 meter by rickshaw how many kilometers did she travel in all so here in the question distance traveled by salma by metro is equal to 15.5 km and distance traveled by salma in rickshaw is equal to 750 meters therefore total distance traveled in all is we have to do addition but students we have to find out total distance covered by salma in kilometers so first of all we will convert 750 meter into kilometers and we know that 1000 meters is equal to 1 kilometer therefore 750 divided by 1000 will be equal to 0.7 Zero kilometers. Now, students, adding both the distances, we will get sixteen point two five zero kilometers. 
Therefore, total distance travelled in all is equal to 16.250 kilometres. I hope, student, this is clear. Now, I hope you can try question number 3 of exercise number 2, which is in your book on page number 154. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.